Mapping Tonal Harmony Pro offers many ways that you can visualize a song. You can view a regular staff with chord changes, include guitar charts, view a full analysis, and so on. In regular mode or in stage mode, it also shows the progression in the harmony map as chords or functionality with or without secondary notation. And you can use different color themes. But how do you change all these settings? And shout out to Hector Rivera for this awesome question. First, remember you can hide or show the map with this button here. You can zoom in and out by pinching on the map. You can also view the map functionally or with chords with the F button here. And if you want to show or hide secondary functional notation in the map, open the maps menu and in the map display preferences, you can toggle the secondary functional notation here. Now the 5-7 of 2 is using the slash functional notation for secondary functions. You can also toggle between showing all available functions in the current key with the I button or just the chords that belong to the song currently loaded. If you want a different color theme for the map, just go inside the maps menu and use the map color theme panel. Now the map is using the Da Vinci theme. If you want to resize the maps panel, just tap once on the dividing line between the map and the score and a thick bar will appear. Now you can drag it up or down to resize the panels. If you drag it all the way down, the map will disappear completely, and when you want to bring it back, you can use the map button again. To change the way the chart looks, you can browse through all the different presets with the staff plus or staff minus buttons. The staff plus goes to the next preset and the minus to the previous one. Also, if the current song has a lot of chords per measure, like for example, Lush Life, and you want to use the big chords template, you can toggle between single or double system breaks with the split systems button here so that the chords fit comfortably on the staff. And that's it. This is the way you tweak how Mapping Tonal Harmony Pro shows you the song. I hope that was helpful and thanks again to Hector for the awesome question and keep them coming. Write them in the comments or send us an email to mdexmusic at gmail.com. We'll create tutorials for all the questions that we can. And visit mdex.com to learn more about mapping Tonal Harmony Pro. We'll see you on the next video.